Okay, so let's try this one. Um, it asks us which statement is incorrect, okay? So let's go through each one of these, A, B, C, D, and find the incorrect statement. So A asks us, or says, two is a conjugate acid of four. Is that correct or incorrect? Correct. It's correct. Why is that? Because when we look at a base to find its conjugate acid, what do we add to it? H plus, really, H plus, okay? So when we add H to this, we get OH, and we add a plus to it, we get minus one, right? Does that make sense? Yes. Okay, so is this, this is correct, right? Okay, so let's put a little check to that. Okay, what about B? Three is a conjugate acid of one. So three, is that a conjugate acid of one there? Yes. Yes, right? Because what do we have to do? Add what? Add H plus, right? And when we add H plus to H2O, right, we get what? H3O plus, right? So that's right. Okay, what about C? 2 is a conjugate base of 4. Is that possible? It can't be. If 2 is a conjugate acid of 4, this can't be. Do you understand? Right? Because a conjugate base, what's the what is the conjugate base of well, there's no conjugate base of four. That's the problem, okay? So two has a conjugate base, but it's not four. Okay? I mean it is four, but uh, that's not the way the question's asked. Okay? So that one's incorrect. What about this one over here? One is a conjugate base of three. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Because what do I do to find the conjugate base? I remove proton. H plus. Yeah, a proton. So that one. Okay. So the wording of this kind of is confusing because four is the conjugate base of two is what it is. Okay. So that's why it's kind of a little confusing. So don't, don't make that mistake. So this is the incorrect answer, which is what this was looking for. Okay? Any questions on that one?